Oh! Oh! I do not remember adding this to cart. Bakit hindi siya nakarap? My gosh, this one is really old. Tada! This one, I'm looking forward to this one. Seriously, the life of Nelson Mandela deserves a lot more pages versus Nelson Mandela. Guys, cannot. This cannot be. I am expecting a bigger box. Free diving. Kasi gusto niya matry mag free diving. So there you have it. So, hi everyone, this is Paul Loves to Read, and today it's a special episode because it's an unboxing episode. And as you know, here in Paul Loves to Read, this is really just a little channel to promote and inspire you guys to love literature. And this is just one of our special episodes for the day. And now, just to add context, okay, the box that you see here in front of me is from an online sale of Big Bad Wolf. Um, so they usually have this, for those who are not familiar with Big Bad Wolf, they usually have this really big, big, big sale um, in person. This is pre-pandemic, diba? Mga usually around 80 to 90% off from the original price. And it's a yearly thing. And since the pandemic started, of course, they couldn't do it in person. Hence, they moved to the online platform. Right? And this is my first box. I am also still waiting for a second box to arrive. Hopefully soon. Um, so yeah. So let's open it. Okay. Medyo makapal siya. And this box, by the way, arrived late. I think it took about more than a month before it finally got here. And you could imagine my my um, a little frustration, and not just me overall from the book community, but you know, we're just happy that it's finally here. And I can't even remember anymore what I ordered, honestly. Um, this is a by the way, the books that I ordered is a combination of my books, my dad's books, and my boyfriend's books. So. Not everything that you will see here are mine, but definitely um, some of it I, you know, I'd be interested to read as well. I ordered this in June 30, as in day one of the sale. I placed an order, and then July 1, second day of the sale, I placed another order. Oh my gosh, that's heavy. I placed another order. Uh, yun yung wala pa, so hopefully dumating siya. Dumating siya this week. Okay. Gosh. Please handle with care. Fragile. Thank you. And it is packed really, really tight. Hand thing cutter. Hindi to kaya ng gunting. I need a cutter for this one. And I'm going to try to avoid touching it. Please. Sana hindi ko ma okay does it also say which side is up so I guess this is a, as good as any okay guys here we go sorry I just need to <laughs> alcohol my <laughs> right. Oh, here we go, guys. Look at that. The first book is already making me smile, and I think this is a contentious choice. Oh my God, nothing makes me happier than books. Look at it. Book number one. Book number one is Kim Jong Il production, the extraordinary true story of a kidnapped filmmaker, his star actress, and a young dictator's rise to power by Paul Fisher. Absolutely no idea what this book is all about, or I mean, we didn't have any idea what this book is prior to the Big Bad Wolf sale, but it seemed like an interesting, you know. Um, 
interesting premise. So, so we added to cart and it's now here. And by the way, the prices of the Big Bad Wolf, the most expensive per book, and this is this is hardbound. The most expensive is 320 pesos. Um, the cheapest is about 120 pesos or 150. Um, and again, that's a very, very good deal. So now we have book number one. Okay. So I think they do give you a way bill. Right, it is here. Yep, this is just order number one. That aside. Second book we have. Oh, gusto to nihan. This is my one of my boyfriend's picks. Fuel your ride, complete performance, nutrition for cyclists. There you go. Another non-fiction. Okay. And then we have another hardbound book. Wow, this one is heavy. It's what I do, A Photographer's Life of Love and War um, by Lindsay Adario. Again, another book by uh, another book that is bought by Ray, picked by Ray. But this is interesting. I think I want to read this too. Okay. So it's about a photographer, a photojournalist um, life. Another one, next book is Over the Top. Uh, the first lone yachtsman to sail vertically around the world. I do not remember adding this to cart. Han, I guess kay Hanto, this is not mine. As I told you earlier, I, you know, I think most of the books here are my dad's and my boyfriend's. I think most of my books are in the second box, but um, we'll see. So yeah, Over the Top by Adrian Flanagan. Yep. Sailed horizontally around the world. Huh. And there's one who sailed around the world vertically. Okay, another nonfiction. Okay, this one is mine. The next one is mine. Pocket condition harap. My gosh, this one is really old. A bit gnarly. Our new <laughs> word of the week at home. Gnarly. Um Nisha <laughs> covered the, the the sleeve is a bit anana. Lukot, but that's okay. We are more interested in the content of the book. So this is Mona Lisa, A Life Discovered by Diane Hales. So another non-fiction about Mona Lisa, who she is, her life, and how did she end up in that painting. So looking forward to this. The first book in the box that is mine. Ang ilan na to? One, two, three, four, five. Sixth book. The sixth book is, I think this is my dad's. Don't be afraid of the bullets and accidental war correspondent in Yemen. Kay papa no? Yeah. I think kay papa to no. Asayo. Okay, sorry. It's it's, it's race, not not my dad's. So, our taste in nonfiction is kind of blend. Uh, by Laura Kasinov. Okay. Cool. Next one, Hardbound, Noam Cohen by Noam Cohen. The Rise, I think this is, is this mine? The Rise of Silicon Valley as a Political Powerhouse and Social Wrecking Ball. The Know-It-Alls. For good and for ill, Silicon Valley is now at the epicenter of our changing world. And these are the 11 men responsible for it. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Next one, ah, binili ko pala to. I don't remember buying it. Catherine the Great. Okay, in the last ba Big Bad Wolf in-person shopping um, sale, I got a Catherine, this book, I got this there, I've read it, but I lost the book. I don't know where. Somebody borrowed it or I lent it to someone and I, I, I don't remember where it went. So, I got this off this year's sale. Siguro mga... 190 to 80 pesos, parang ganyan. So, yay, I got a copy. Pero nabasa ko siya, I read it. One of my best books of 2020. The next one is related to Catherine the Great because it's Peter the Great. 
This is mine. I'm a sucker for history. Same author as Catherine the Great. Same author. Um, so, looking forward to reading this. And I'm very optimistic that it's going to be a good one. guys and we're not even done next one this one's mine title pa lang. the imperial wife by Irina rain uh, I think this is fiction yeah I think this is fiction so another historical um, period piece um, historical fiction and looking forward to reading that there's a few more we're not yet done Ta-da! This one, I'm looking forward to this one. Birds, Art, Life. A Year of Observation by Keo McClear. Um, so I'm looking forward to this book because when I read the synopsis, summary, and some of the feedback review, got really very interested. Um, I'm not into bird watching or anything like that and I don't believe this book is about bird watching. It's really about birds, art and life and how each connect to each other. So yeah. Um almost there. Ah I think this is a nonfiction. Um it's called Slave and it's by Jason Johnson. This is a nonfiction, Tama no hun. This is a non-fiction about uh, parang ano, parang real life taken. Yung movie ni, ni Liam Neeson. Liam Neeson, there you go. Yung, yung movie ni Liam Neeson, yung taken, yung part one. Yung first movie. So parang real life siya. Um, account. Okay. Next. Ah, this one's fine. Another, uh, uh, no, another. This one is fiction, The Hundred Year House by Rebecca Mackay. Um, I I've, I've looked it up. Seems like a good, you know, seems like a good read. So I'm just gonna try it out. Okay. This one. I have no idea why I added this to cart. Cauliflower. Cauliflower by Nicola Barker. Honestly, no idea why I added this. Actually, tinanong din ako ni Ray bakit ko daw to inad, and I don't know. Just something about it. Yep. So we'll see. Di ba pala tapos? Ah, manipis lang pala siya. Tree shaker? It's so thin. I was expecting this to be much thicker and heavier. Tree shaker, the life the life of Nelson Mandela 1918 to 2013. Seriously, the life of Nelson Mal Mandela deserves a lot more pages, guys. I, I cannot. The life of Nelson Mandela from 1918 to 2013, and you're going to give me a very small format and very thick, a uh, thick, thin? I am confused. This is confusing. This is confusing to me. Why do we have a Nelson Mandela nonfiction that is this thin? You cannot do an abridged version of it. Baka naman may kasama siya na hindi ko pa nakikita. Surely, I, I can't get over it. I have Lenin, the dictator, who has at least more than an inch of pages versus Nelson Mandela. Guys, cannot. This cannot be. I am confused. I am confused. I am expecting a bigger book, a heavier, hardbound book for Mr. Nelson Mandela. But ganun, Han. That's weird. And this one, guys, is this, I, I remember it. This is three, one of the more expensive ones, 320 or 380. Right? It's supposed to be one of the higher rates. Yes, a uh, high tier. To, eh. Because of the content, right? I mean, to be expected. Let's see. Let's see. But see. <laughs> but I. I'm beating now. I can't. 
but in the end, I can't get over it. <laughs> and then Lenin, well, Lenin is Lenin, but still, compared naman to dapat pareho lang sila. But anyway, okay, Lenin the dictator, I think this is my dad's um, pick. Hindi ako makaget over. Lastly, um, Red Azalea. This is another non fiction. Actually, I don't know. Yeah, it's a non fiction. It's a memoir. Okay. It's a memoir, New York Times notable book, uh, Red Azalea by Anchi Min. Okay. One breath, ito yung hindi mo. One breath is here. Akala ko nasa second box. So he's happy. Um, free diving, death, and the quest to shatter human limits. Free diving. Kasi gusto niya matry mag free diving. But I have thoughts about free diving. <laughs> I'm scared. Last book is my dad's book. Douglas MacArthur, American Warrior. <laughs> Bigat. Very heavy book, hardbound. Um, again, one of the one of the nasa high tier um, ano siya, book price. So there you have it. We managed to unbox. Let's count it: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. 19, okay. 19 books. Uh, believe it or not, this is, all of these books are about Less than a hundred dollars for all of these books. So that's a very, very, very good deal. If I'm just gonna get, I'm just gonna grab one. Usually my price yan sa likod eh. Ito. You will your ride. It is $19.99 US dollar. Can you imagine that? And then this one is, <laughs> doesn't say, sorry. This one is $11.99, $11. So, for all of these books, less than $100 for 19 books. It's a mix of fiction, non-fiction, hardbound, paperback. Um, it's a very good deal, guys. Is it worth the more than one month's wait? Yes, it is. It is worth the more than one month wait. But maybe not so much the frustration. But basta, it's, it's a different story, but... But still, happy with this first box. Looking forward to the second box. Hopefully this week as well. So there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed that as much as we did. <laughs> we have a lot of reading to do. 